My name is Maria, and today I want to show you how you can download, export, and share tables from the Decennial Census Demographic and Housing Characteristics file, or DHC. I also want to show you how you can access this data from the File Transfer Protocol, or FTP, site. The DHC provides demographic and housing characteristics data for a range of geographies found in the United States and Puerto Rico, including age, sex, race, Hispanic or Latino origin, household type, family type, relationship to householder, group quarters population, housing occupancy, and housing tenure. Let's go to data.census.gov so I can show you how it's done. Let's say that I want to find the single year of age tables from the DHC for all the counties in Indiana. Once I go to data.census.gov, I can use the single search bar as a shortcut. Type single year of age into the search bar and hit enter. It adds the age and sex filters to my search, but also recognizes the text. So among other tables, it brings up the PCT12 series of tables from the decennial census, and it looks like those are exactly what I was looking for. Before I click on the table though, I wanna finish adding the other filters that I'll need. The one for the counties in Indiana and the one to make sure that all the data is coming from the 2020 DHC. I wanna make sure that these tables are still available once these other criteria are included in the search. To add the counties in Indiana, from the left, click on Geography, County, Indiana, and check the box for all counties within Indiana. Then from the left again, click on Surveys, Decennial Census, and check the box next to the Demographic and Housing Characteristics file. Once these two filters are selected, click on the X in the upper right corner of the panel to close it. And it appears that the PCT12 series of tables is still available. Click on the first one, PCT12, sex by single year age, to get the data for all races, rather than getting data broken out by race like it is found in the rest of the tables that make up the series. So now that I have the table that I need, what are my options for getting it into Excel? The first option is to export the table. I can either export to Excel or export to a CSV format. The exported version of the table looks very similar to what you see on the screen, and it is the best option if you're looking for a presentation-ready format. Let me export the table to Excel by clicking on the Excel button. Once it opens, you'll see that there are two different worksheets. The first, labeled Information, provides information on the data set, the filters used, and notes about the table. The second, labeled Data, provides the actual table of data. And as you can see, it's formatted in a way that makes it easy to read. The other option I have is to download the table to a .zip file. Once I click on the Zip button, a prompt will appear telling me to download a CSV version. If I click that button, the .zip file opens. For every table you download, you'll receive three files. One called Column Metadata, one called Table Notes, and one called data. The data one is the one you'll want. When you open it, probably the first thing that you'll notice is that it looks very different from the exported version of the table. When you download, you're going to get the data in a flat, machine-readable file. One of the perks of using the downloaded version, though, is you'll get the GeoID, which is a unique identifier for each geography. Another thing that I wanted to show you is the share button. If you click on that, you are presented the option to share the table to different social media platforms or send it to someone else via email. You can also copy the link directly to save or share with someone else. There's one other thing I wanna show you and that's how to access the data from the FTP site. One of the biggest reasons that data users use the FTP site is to do a bulk download of the data. To get to the DHC data location in the FTP site, click on the More Data button found in the ribbon above the table. Then click on the Continue to Site button to go to the FTP. I hope this tutorial has helped in learning how to export, 
download and share tables you find from the 2020 Demographic and Housing Characteristics file, as well as access the data through the FTP site. For more guidance on using data.census.gov, please visit our resources page at the link below. Thank you.